I might uh, come down here and upgrade these first few blocks to titanium. I don't think I... We probably don't need to, though, but I don't know. We'll see. Either that or we'll just keep an eye on them, and if it's a big... Comes up. Parent that. Uh, Houston. Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to get back to work on the base and the roof, and hopefully by the end of this episode, we will have a working... Uh, landing and taking off platform for our gyrocopter, and then we'll take it out for a spin. So that is the plan. Uh, all right, so let's see here. I went out uh, off camera and mined up a bunch more stone and am in the process of converting that stone into powder. Uh, so let's grab the powder that we currently have and throw that up there, and we're going to convert all of that into more concrete mix. Um, and then over here, we're making, uh, or will be making more concrete blocks. So let's uh, make 53 more of those. And then I have a few things I have to put away here. <clears throat> and uh, what I'm doing, uh, what we're going to do first is we're going to go down all the way to the ground. And we're going to make sure we have a support pillar of concrete that goes from the ground all the way up to the top because each floor is set up a little bit differently and I just want to make sure we have a support pillar going all the way uh, to the ground for the roof and so I'm pretty much finished with the exterior walls here um, there's still a lot more flooring and stuff that needs to be uh, put in at some point but um, I want to get the roof on because we need to get the roof on before we can really finish working up here. And again, uh, I just want to make sure we have another support pillar somewhere more or less in the center uh, of these floors all the way down to the ground. So that way, you know, we know it's going to be um, stable. Okay. Uh, so that is what we are doing. All right. Uh, do we have any points to spend? Uh, let's take a look at that. Skills. We have one perk point to spend. We are focusing on fortitude. Um, so let's see. I think that we put a point into pain tolerance and a point into healing factor the last time. Field medic. Medical healing items restore terms of more health over time and give 40% more XP when used. Um, yeah, that would, that would make our basic... I don't care about the XP so much, but the, the bandages would be nice uh you know getting more healing from bandages gift of life is just straight up going to give us more health to our health cap um but i think what i want to do is i want to just keep working on fortitude directly because the stuff that's the most important to me is boomstick and pain tolerance and healing factor uh, when we get this we re basically restore a hit point every six seconds and critical wounds uh, don't last as long uh, so let's just focus on on fortitude directly and keep pumping that up so we can get these three in particular up. We might put a couple points in Gift and Life later. We might put a couple points in Field Medic uh, also. We'll see how things go. Very good. Let's grab um, the uh, whatever blocks are currently available here. We have 146 so far. What are you doing? You're not doing anything right at the moment. Okay. And you're making that, and you should be... Oh, you're making steel ingots, right. Okay. So let's just grab another bunch of these, and we can have you uh, work on making more cement. 407, yep. Okay, time's good on that. Looks like we just ran out of fuel in our genies. Uh, so let's get those topped off. Grab all of those up there. Oh, that made us heavy. Oh, I also have been, uh, I made some pumpkin pie in the campfire too. Uh, so we have 12 of those. We have a lot of pumpkins and a lot of other stuff. So I figured let's make some pumpkin pie. Uh, this gives us 
50 food, 25 health, and 20 maximum stamina bonus. So it's good mid-level food. And, um, yeah, I suppose we can eat one of those right now. Why not? I grabbed a few cans down from the vending machine down below. And, um, yeah, we, well, actually, hold on a sec. Okay, we can make a spaghetti. We make two spaghettis. Nice. And looks like that's it for the high-end stuff for the moment. So we'll make those. Let's put the hackers in here. Uh, we'll put the copies in here for now. And go up and get the generators re refueled. I don't think the garden is ready yet to harvest. Oh, also, I made a decision about what I'm going to do up top here so I'll show you that uh, but basically what I think I want to do is I want to now let's restart this okay uh, I decided I like this raised area so rather than tear all of the raised area out we're gonna leave it there but I'm going to expand it all the way to the edge of that side of the building and all the way to the edge of that side of the building. That's the reason why, you know, we need to get this, uh, this roof fixed and repaired. <clears throat> so, and then we'll, you know, we'll put in ra railing here and railing all the way around. And then the idea is that uh, I was going to use this kind of as a back stop, but we actually need well we don't necessarily need but i'd like to have more room for landing coming in you know for landing than for taking off for taking off you know from about here to this point would be enough but what we'll do for the takeoff is we'll just have a ramp that goes right off the side of the building um you know when we do our takeoffs uh so basically just kind of envision a couple of uh runways uh, one for taking off and one for landing, and that's the general idea that I have in mind here. So I removed all of the the metal buildings and and all the you know metal stuff and left these concrete blocks in place, and, and we'll build all of this up here. Let's jump back down here and uh, we'll grab those blocks. We'll grab whatever concrete mix we currently have and we're just going to keep pumping out the blocks because we're going to need quite a few more before this is all said and done that's for sure all right so here's what i want to do um i think the simplest way to handle this is to cut our way down so that way we know uh everything uh, you know that we're using the right uh th that everything is lined up properly is what my my mouth's trying to say <laughs> uh, so let's jump down here and um, we, we want this to be right about in the middle um, of the of this opening which is going to be right about here and this is just going to be a pillar going all the way up so this will be where we'll start here and we're just going to like I said, cut all the way down to the to the ground. All right, what is going on here? That is weird, man. I don't know what's going on with that. Maybe it's a a graphical glitch or something. Oh, that's right. We got a bunch of screamies down here from all the heat I've been generating. Oh, that's going to be fun. Okay. Okay, let's let's grab um these guys. Okay, 
That worked out pretty good. Just have to wait for these bodies to get out of the way. Um, and you also. Okay. That gets us where we need to go. I might uh, come down here and upgrade these first few blocks to titanium. I don't think I... We probably don't need to, though, but I don't know. We'll see. Either that or we'll just keep an eye on them, and if it's a big... Comes apparent that... Uh... Houston? Can somebody explain to me what just happened? Um... Okay, I think we've ghosted through. Uh, okay. While we're here, <laughs> can we take her out? Oh, look at that. That was like total hacks, but that's not my fault. That's the damn game's fault. Um, all right. Can we, can we get out this way? I don't think I'd, oh, there we go. Oh man, that was weird. Okay, let's, um, whoops. Let's go back over here. Uh, let's see, we were over here, right? Yeah. Why don't we... Okay, yeah, so those blocks are still there. Uh, I have to assume that the blocks are underneath there. Just for some reason, the game, like, lost my collision, or, uh, I guess. I'm That is just weird, man. Okay. Um, <coughs> well, let's hop up here, then. And go back up this way. I wonder if if, if it's going to keep doing that if we keep, you know, nerd pulling. Okay. <laughs> I'm a little bit, uh, a little bit concerned now. Uh, let's just try it. Keep trying it. If it happens again from higher up, we're going to have a really big fall. And now we just have to go up to the very top. This would be a very bad time for that glitch to happen again. <laughs> We'd fall. We'd like totally break our legs. Maybe even die. I don't know. Um, One more. Okay. That's it. We've done it. Now, can we... What we're going to have to do is we're going to have to, yikes, do this so I can get over to there. All right. And then same thing on this side. Easy. Easy does it there. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay. You knew that was going to happen, didn't you? I should have taken a no shits. Um, damn it. All right. I'll take one of those. And we'll take one of those. Yeah, that was that was a bit of a drop, wasn't it? Okay, let's go back up and try it again. You're really just going to be a pain in the ass, aren't you? How can I not reach that block? Hmm. 
Okay. Uh, I don't know why this can reach it and the jackhammer couldn't, but maybe I was just not quite on the right spot, I guess. Oh, we're hitting the top lock. Well, you know what? Whatever. If that's what we got to do to get rid of it, that's what we got to do. Oh, and since we're still not done with this precarious work here, let's get, let's actually take an oh shit drops. I know it sometimes it takes me a while, guys, but I usually figure it out. Oh, those only last for five minutes. That's not a long time, but hopefully it'll be long enough to finish this little task here. Uh, okay, so now we want to. Easy, 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 easy. Easy does it. Not quite far enough to reach there. If the lag spike happened right at the moment that I moved over the edge, then that would not be good. Okay. No lag spikes, please. Can we reach that? Yes, we can. All right. Look at that. We got the we got the cross in place. Now we just got to fill things up. Um, so I guess I'll just start working from this side. You know, one one thing we could do, though, we don't we don't necessarily have to fill this in because we're gonna go up another layer anyway. It would look a little odd from down below, but. I'll tell you what, we're going to compromise. We're going to do a compromise here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill in here. And I'm going to remove these blocks. And essentially what we're going to do is we're just going to we're going to make four symmetrical <coughs> squares at the top of this roof that we won't fill in. We'll fill in the next layer. It's just you know, it's just going to save us resources, but if we do happen to be down below and looking up, it'll it'll look like we intended it to be that way. So just don't tell anybody else, okay? That's just a secret between you and me. But we'll just pretend that's what we meant to do all along. It is. Alrighty then. Now, I am going to... Here, let's fill this in. The skylight. Okay. And well, you know, we didn't actually need to do that either, but that's okay. I am going to stick with this extra walkway on the edge, mostly because I don't think we need to fill it in A and B. It kind of looks cool. Um, so what we're going to do then is we'll take the remaining blocks and we'll just uh, do the outline here. And then I'll fill it in as I get more blocks later. And I think I'm just going to keep that as a little indented place. There's no point in keeping the uh, indenting the platform out that way either. <coughs> I don't think we need to do that. Okay. I'll also finish, you know, putting these half blocks in just because that's the design of the building. How many blocks do I have left? 17. Okay, let's fill this in. And fill this part in. And then we'll just keep working our way out this way. 
And that's all we have for the moment. Okay, it's coming along. So what's going to happen here now is we're going to uh, fill all of this in all the way over to the edge. We'll finish out uh, the half block edge of the building. And when that's done, oh yeah, I got to fill this back in over here too. Uh, when that's done, we'll put rails in. We'll get uh, the paint out and paint this to, to look like some runways and build... I mean, I don't, we don't really need a ramp, actually. We just basically fly right off the edge of the building and take off. So, yeah, I'll figure that out, though, uh, when the time comes. But I think this should work okay. Uh, why don't we do this, though? Why don't we go down back to the ground floor? Uh, this is probably completely unnecessary, but I'm going to do it anyways. And I want to upgrade those bottom three blocks uh, to titanium just because if they did happen to break that one support it might cause SI issues it might not either I don't know but you know we have the resources so let's just do it let's just get her done um, so if we're gonna do three blocks is that 15 or 30 I don't remember let's just take or yeah, let's take 60 with this. I don't think we need that many. And then for, oh, titanium plate. That's right, we're super low on titanium. And we were going to go out and get some more titanium, weren't we? I forgot about that. Okay, well, what we'll do for now then is we'll, we'll just upgrade them to steel. All right, how are we doing on this? Still working away at it. All right. We have a ton more stone dust coming so i think what i'll do is well here let's make more concrete mix there you are done with metal so let's have you um make more cement or actually here let's have you make 200 cement and then you can make more except for now i can't move can i reach that yeah And you can make approximately a hundred. Put that stuff in there and put these actually here. No, let's make turn these seven into uh, more gas. We're getting low on oil shale again. Okay, so, um, let's see here. Yeah, we, we're definitely not going to get that finished, <coughs> excuse me, by the end of this episode. Sorry about that, but it's just not going to happen because we're being held up by this stone. And I don't have time in real life to wait for it to finish to finish up this episode. So here, so let's, um, let's do this. Let's spend the rest of this episode. We'll just go out into the wasteland and grab ourselves some more surface titanium and kill a couple zombies uh, to end things out for today. Uh, so I'm going to take that down with me. Um, we want the Valkyrie drill for the uh, titanium. We'll take the the jackhammer with us though too and so we'll just get enough titanium until we run out of durability in the valkyrie drill put this back in there and oh we used we used up some of our steel to repair that so let's grab i i think i only need 15 or 30 i just can't remember though so um also i think we'll take the motorcycle just because it's, you know, faster and more maneuverable. And it does need some fuel. Um, here, let's leave that one can in there. And we'll take a couple of cans with us because we'll need some for the Valkyrie anyways. Uh, okay, let's take a look at the map of Ruski here. Um, we have been through here for titanium. Um, that's the mine. 
We could look around maybe in this general vicinity, but we can also see it. I think it's, um, I think they're the, these white, ooh, there's a nice little batch of titanium there. That could possibly be the start of another smaller mine. Yeah, let's go, let's actually go there. Okay, so we have these two nodes here. Um, wasn't there three, though? Or just these two? It looks like there's two right kind of, yeah, there is two. Glitch right into each other. Okay, so yeah, I'll tell you what, let's, let's just start a new, smaller titanium mine in this general vicinity. And we'll, um, you know, that way we'll, we'll have a new supply of it. And we'll just uh, keep, you know, digging down until we get, you know, finish the veins out. Because my original titanium mine, the very the big one we did, um, I exhausted that in, in terms of the titanium. In fact, I exhausted everything in that, and it's just nothing but stone now. Um, but I created a stone quarry clo uh, closer to the base just because... You know, I didn't want to have to go so far for it. Okay, so let's get these done first. Um, I have a Rock Busters with me, so let's take that. Uh, unfortunately, I left the coffee back at the base. So that would have given us a boost. Oh, and I, for <laughs> Damn it. I forgot to upgrade those blocks with our steel. Uh, well, hopefully I'll remember when we get back. There's a Copper Ruski over there. And a Ronald McDonald Aruski here. Don't spit at me, cop. Off with your head. Okay. So let's um dig down a little bit. I'm not going to bother trying to make this an underground mine. It's just going to be open pit. It's too much of a pain to try and keep it from collapsing. So, where was the other one? Was it here? Uh -oh. oh, right here. Anybody else? Are we cool? We're cool. Okay, now let's go ahead and. Ah, oh, shit, we got a screamer coming in. There we go. Let's take that point and throw it right on into Fort. And then now that we're level five, we should be able to get the next level of Boomer, Pain Tolerance, and the Healing Factor when the time comes. Oh, crap. Is this a wandering horde? Kind oh, of looks that way, doesn't it? Okay, where's my bike? Oh shit, get on the bike. On the bike, please, thank you. That's a lot of zombos. Okay. Back to this. So, what I'm going to do is probably start right about here ish. And let's use the, uh, the jackhammer. And we're just going to make ourselves like a little rectangle for the pit. I'm going to go ahead and just mine all of it because here again I need the stone and the sand rather than try and collapse it. Not good. Oh shit. On the motorcycle. On the motorcycle. Get on the motorcycle. There you go. Alright you guys. Well, 
Um, I think we're going to wrap up the episode here. I'm going to just kind of keep working on this little uh, titanium quarry for a little while anyway. I don't know if I'll uh, spend, spend the whole rest of the day working on it, but uh, work on it for a little bit more, get some more titanium supplied and more stone and all of that, and then go back to the base and keep making more concrete. I'll probably finish the structural part of the roof, at least getting all the rest of the blocks down, because you guys now know, you know what the plan is for that. And then when I'm ready to do the actual runways, uh, that will start the next episode at that point. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.